Hi awesome people. Welcome to our Pets Academic channel. Today, I'm talking about the topic, how much does a capybara cost? If you are new to our Pets Academic channel, please subscribe. You can also like and comment on our videos so that we can get to know you better. Consider reading the full in-depth blog post I have written on this topic. You can find it by going to the link in the description. So, let's dive in. Capybaras are a species of rodent found in South America. They are the largest rodents in the world and can weigh up to 65 pounds. Capybaras live near water and feed mainly on grasses, plants, and fruit. If you're looking for a unique pet, you may be wondering how much it will cost to own one. The cost of a capybara can range from $1,000 to $3,000, depending on the age, size, and health of the animal. Why are capybaras expensive? Capybaras are the largest rodents in the world and, unfortunately, can be quite expensive. This is because capybaras require a lot of special care and attention to ensure their health and well-being. They need a large enclosure with plenty of space to roam around, as well as access to water for swimming. Capybaras also require special diets and social interaction. Because they are so large, they can be difficult to transport, adding additional costs to their care. Many capybaras are bred in captivity, which can drive up prices even further. This is because breeders must provide housing and food for the animals as well as proper medical care. Breeding also requires a significant investment in time and money. How to maintain a capybara? Capybaras require a high-fiber, low-fat diet that is rich in grasses and aquatic plants, provide them with access to fresh water at all times, and supplement their diet with hay, fruits, and vegetables. Capybaras are social animals and should be kept with other capybaras. Provide them with a large enclosure or pond, and make sure they have plenty of grasses and aquatic plants available to munch on. The most important part of maintaining a capybara is providing it with regular veterinary care. They should be taken to the vet annually for checkups and when they are sick or injured. In the full blog post I have written on my website, I have done hours of research and I have written much more details about the above topic and subtopics. The blog article is more than a thousand words, and I dive into each of the above topics covering many more questions around them. Just click the link below, and you can read all about my research on this topic. See you inside the blog post, and let me know if you have any more questions in the comments below. Have a great day, and thank you for checking out PetsAcademic.com.